Hello Libra, thank you for tuning into my channel. I definitely appreciate all the love and support and I send it right back to you guys. Please be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel and leave a comment this reading resonates. Um, happy birthday to all my Libras out there. I hope you guys are enjoying your birthday season. Let's go ahead and see what messages are coming through. Spirit of love and light, truth and clarity. What messages do you have for a time of Libra? Please and thank you. Okay. So you're being guided to make some healthy choices here. Looking at pictures, missing you. So it looks like y'all could be in the process of doing what's best for you. Um, improving your overall quality of life. Just feeling happier. Doing what makes you feel happy. But... In the meanwhile, you have someone who is missing you, someone who has a lot of regrets here, someone who could be like watching your profile or they have pictures of you, um, but it's someone who's feeling like very nostalgic about you. Some of y'all could have made some diet changes here and you've been getting into shape, feeling much better about yourself as well. Okay. The challenge is it looks like this is someone that you do have a bit of a history with and it looks like it's kind of like this bittersweet energy coming from this situation you guys could have like children with this person you could have been married to this person yeah because of separation so i'm getting like this person knows how to pull on your heartstrings and it's because like it, this is someone that you have some history with and you, it's not all bad memories okay so you can't just kind of like just completely disregard this person because there were good times there and especially if you have children with this person the, so something some source he'll release so there's going to be some sort of shocking transformation that takes place in this situation to each his own. Um, some of y'all may be shocked to see that this person has actually evolved and grown. Um, some of y'all, you're going to end up shocking this person by just completely releasing this situation. Okay. Some of you guys could have met someone at a party or there is an energy of someone coming into your life and you having a lot of fun with this person. You could have met this person here at a party or through friends or you and this person just had a lot of fun together. Um, some of y'all though, I'm getting some of y'all met someone recently or you will be meeting someone recently. And it looks like you're this is someone that you're going to end up having a lot of fun with. This person could have kind of like a bohemian type of um, style here. But it looks like this is someone that you're going to be building a friendship with. Like you enjoy being around this person. Okay. So we got a girl with a snake. So charmed or used and we have heartbroken so we'll dive a little deeper into that but there's a particular situation that you guys are being warned to avoid because you could end up being love bombed and heartbroken So someone is saying in this situation, they're done stalking or trying to figure out everything that you're up to because if, unless this is you, Libra, because someone here has been watching someone like obsessively watching someone and they're saying, you know, this is not healthy for me. It's not helping with my healing here. So someone is saying, okay, I'm about to like completely withdraw my energy from this so I can focus on my healing. Yeah, because it looks like there's someone that keeps running. Either when things get tough, this person clocks out or this person has been running. 
And that's why you guys are putting up your boundaries here. You know, this, I'm going to tell you what, someone in here loves toxic relationships. They love, they thrive off of it. It looks like the person you guys were connected to actually thrived off of a toxic environment and toxic relationships. Because if it's not toxic, then they are not in love. They really feel like they're in love they they it's like this fiery energy from this person where if it's not toxic then they just don't get a thrill from it they need like that tox that toxic energy in a relationship in order to thrive so I'm going to tell you guys what, it's definitely whoever I'm talking to. So you guys are about to meet someone new if you haven't met someone new. Because there is an energy that you guys are separating yourself uh, from. And it's because like you realize something out of this situation. And in order to like honor yourself, to protect yourself, you are moving on with your life. And it looks like there's someone that you will be dating here. Or someone that you're interested in dating. Let's get your advice. Love is coming. You guys have a new connection coming towards you. Yeah, it's a new beginning. Whatever was going on in the past, let that go. It's, it's not... If you entertain that connection anymore, you're going to end up being really disappointed, being charmed and used by this person, just being really sad. If you allow this person back into your life. Um, let me pull. Let me pull a card from here to clarify your most likely outcome. friends to lovers free yourself yeah you guys are needing to free yourself there is some sort of friendship that will be developing between you and someone uh and it looks like you and this person will really hit it off very well with one another but you're needing to free yourself from some other energy now it doesn't mean that you guys are already in a relationship with someone else it just simply means that there is still someone in your energy that you haven't fully released and this creates blockages for you. It, it creates a blockage so that as new love is trying to enter into your life, it doesn't flow towards you as naturally and as easily as it should. So go ahead and remove those blockages. Let's go ahead and see what else. I'll move this out the way. I am definitely okay. So I have a Libra here who is attracting a lot of attention. There will be people talking about something that you're doing. Because overall energy is career. So this here, right, is this here is talking about your career. You guys are upgrading. It's like there's a level of success that you're stepping into. Okay, that people will be talking about. Um, I'm also getting like some of y'all could be single mothers here. I'm definitely getting a feminine energy here, but it can go either way. But like you give a, you give off this 
cold, distant type of energy. Um, but it actually attracts a lot of people towards you because people find it very mysterious and they want to know more about you. So it works for you in your benefit when it comes to your career, but there is definitely something here. Like people will be talking about some sort of success that's coming in for you here. I'm, I'm going to tell you guys what, because I am seeing like this continuing on with your career. And what I'm really getting is like some of y'all could be questioning something working out for you. And it is definitely going to work out for you. As long as you guys remain committed to it, it's going to pay off for you. You will have some haters here. It is some people that are going to be like really jealous about some sort of attention that you're getting and something that you're doing here that's actually working out for you fantastically. The reason why these people are upset about what you have going on in your life is because they feel like they are stuck somewhere that they're not happy with. They feel like you can, you are moving to this place in your life where you are doing what you truly love and you're earning good money from it. But it's some people that you could work with now or you worked with in the past or you went to school with these people and things did not turn out in their life the way they were hoping and they're seeing your dreams your aspirations becoming your reality here people will be talking about it and it's just simply because they're not happy with what's going on in their own life so you can't give this much attention or much thought just let it be and don't feed into this energy now let's see is there any last messages for love You're mysterious. I told you guys, people are attracted to this mysterious energy that you put off. Playing games. And the thing is, is that people are so attracted to you. Some people will think that this, what you have going on here, you act, they gonna think that you are just acting. They think that it's just a part of a game uh, for you to attract people towards you. But people don't realize this is who you truly are. You're not that type of person to it. You're you're good with being on your own and people are not used to um, other people being like that. You just don't feel the needs to fit in. Some of y'all used to, but you realize there's nothing to fit into. Will you listen? People begging for it's on. You're going to have people from the past wanting your attention. It's going to be new energies coming towards you as well. You will have people competing for your love and affection. It looks like, I'm going to tell you guys what, it looks like you will be meeting someone through work. Or if, it's, if you don't actually meet this person through work, you will meet this person like when they're coming in from work or like this person is a workaholic. They work a lot. But you do too. So... It looks like the both of you guys are hustlers. But I'm going to tell you what. People will be competing for your affection. So, you guys will not be short of any relationship. You will have options to choose from. It's up to you. So, I'm saying for this Libra energy that's coming through, you guys are very goal-oriented. And you have a lot of people that find your energy very attractive. I will leave it there. These are the messages that are coming through for you guys. If you're interested in a personal reading, be sure to check out my uh, description box and you can email me. I'm leaving them open right now. So, but with that being said, happy birthday. You all take care.